everybody welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome don't forget to like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel down below in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys what i eat in a day to get thick it was highly requested so let's just jump right into this video this is just a disclaimer i don't eat the same thing every single day this is just a random video showing you guys what i'm eating today so just keep that in mind so the first thing I like to do as soon as I wake up is have a cup of water. Then I like to enjoy a hot cup of coffee. So I decided for breakfast I'm going to be making some scrambled eggs. So here I'm just going to be melting some butter and I'm just going to get the eggs prepared. I'm just going to season my eggs with a little salt and pepper. You guys can add whatever you want. I'm just going to add in a little bit of spinach. I'm just going to throw my eggs on top and then I'm going to scramble them. Now that they're ready, I'm just going to add them to my bowl. So now I'm just going to fry up some turkey bacon. While those are frying, I'm just going to add some waffles into the toaster. Now I'm just gonna add this to my bowl. The waffles are done, so now we're just gonna add those. So this is the syrup that I'm using today. I'm actually gonna measure out two tablespoons of the syrup so that way I can get the right amount of calories. So this completes my breakfast, it's 650 calories. For a snack, I'm just gonna drink my Ensure Plus, it's 350 calories. For lunch, I'm just gonna have a can of tuna and some sweet potato on the side. So I'm just gonna add three scoops of mayonnaise and then I'm just gonna season it up. So the tuna comes out to 135 calories. Now I'm just gonna cut up some sweet potatoes and I'm gonna cut them into cubes. Now I'm just going to do the same thing to the other potatoes. Once I'm done, I'm just going to bake it in the oven. The oil that I like to use is grapeseed oil. I'm just going to drizzle a little bit in the pan. And now I'm going to actually season up the potatoes before I put them in there.
this is how they came out. I'm only going to use one cup, so it's going to be 114 calories. So the next snack I'm actually going to eat is a smoothie. Um, I like to use frozen fruit. Today I'm going to be using the triple berry blend. I'm just going to use one cup of it. I'm going to throw in a frozen banana. I'm going to put in a little bit of spinach. And one cup almond milk. I'm also going to add in one scoop of protein powder. So this is the protein powder that I'm using today. I tend to alternate between the whey protein and the plant-based protein. It was a little too thick, so I'm just gonna add one more cup of almond milk. Okay, so the shake comes out to 482 calories. So for dinner, I just wanted to keep it simple. So I'm having two peanut butter and jellies on two bagels. Now I'm just going to make another one and both of them come out to 1,000 calories. So the bagels that I used were 270 calories. I used two of them. My jelly was 40 calories and the peanut butter was 190 calories. Okay guys, so we reached the end of the video. Hope you guys liked and enjoyed and if you did, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel down below. Also turn on your bell notifications so that way when I post a new video, you guys can get notified. Until next time, bye!